So here's a series that I had scanned in, and this is from Spanko, and you can see that when it scans in, uh, it's, it's rotated sideways, uh, just the nature of how it scans in. So we have to get this rotated. And you can use Photoshop, but I prefer to actually use Automator. It comes with uh, OS X, and it's free, and it's very, very fast. So I created a little application here, and I can show you how to do this. This is super, super simple. I'm just going to create a new one, and you'll see I'm going to select Application. Go Choose. And I'm going to go down to the, the side toolbar over here, and I'm going to choose Photos. From there, you'll see down near the bottom, Rotate Images. I'm just going to drag that into my workflow. It's going to ask me if I want to copy it, uh, copy the original file so I have a backup of them. Uh, you really don't need it. Just don't add. So the rotate is going to be to the left. So then I'm going to save this workflow. It's somewhere, uh, maybe in a job folder or maybe even application, desktop, anywhere. I'm just going to name this rotate. Now, I'm going to take this, and I actually have the application in my dock. You don't need to have an Automator open for this. So I'm just going to take all my files after they're selected and drag them over the application that the Automator application that's currently in my dock. And you see it is, it's rotating all of them very, very quickly. Um, it's super fast. And you can see here that it's been rotated. Now, uh, once you make this little automator application, you don't need to redo it every time. All you need to do is have it on your desktop, it's in your dock, whatever. You just select everything and just drag directly to it. It is faster than opening Photoshop. 